Hey guys, this is Scott with Homestead Healing. Uh, I think this is my first time really being on the videos. Uh, Stacy's husband, so hopefully you'll be seeing a little bit more of me on here. Still trying to get used to it. But we are on our way to Church Supply today to get us some baby chicks so that we can raise them, get some eggs out of them, and eventually get some meat. So we got some of the stuff set up at home already, but we're going to get the chickens and then get a few more supplies that we need. I'm going to take you along for the ride and see you when we get there. We're getting baby chicks. Um, I don't know. I don't know what to do. Stop it. Stop it.
All right, we finally got the baby chick set up. Um, we got, uh, you know, a little tarp over so that they can get some uh, shade and which we're gonna move them in the shop if it rains or anything. But um, we got some rocks around to, you know, help with a little bit more predator protection. We don't really have any predators around here except for maybe like a stray cat or we haven't seen any raccoons and our neighbor down the road hasn't really had any problems with raccoons but you know go ahead and try to prepare for them a little bit uh, the little one with the splay leg has been walking a little bit um, they're already pecking at the ground but y'all eat up and get big and fat and you know we'll just keep y'all posted on them and let you all let y'all see them grow thanks for tuning in um y'all don't forget to like share and subscribe thanks bye hey guys um so i took a closer look at that little free chick that they gave us and i am pretty sure that um it's just some splay leg going on because his legs go out you know and he can't really stand up but i mean other than that see i don't know if you can really tell but his legs just keep on and he can't really walk so uh, I'm gonna try a method that I found online. I'm gonna, it's a little uh, hair rubber band and a piece of straw to kind of hold his legs together and we're gonna see if that works. Just hold him upside down. Um, you can already tell that he's being able to go. You can already tell that he's being able to set up a little bit better. Um, it, uh, it said that it could take you know anywhere from 24 to 48 hours for his legs to you know completely start straightening up. And of course, you know he's going to have to learn how to you know move them the correct way and all that. Uh, his toes don't seem that bad. I think. Uh, I think he'll be able to straighten them out um, as he learns to to walk correctly. But that's what I uh, I think this is gonna work. You know, he still will be able to move his legs a little bit and all that. But I mean, you know, he's got plenty of food and stuff in his little crop, and so he's been eating and all that. So other than that, I mean, he seems pretty healthy. So we'll keep y'all updated on him. 